Now, this morning I got up and I was hungry and I decided to go out and make myself a nice uh, alfalfa shake. And so I filled this uh, blender halfway uh, with uh, alfalfa that I cut with scissors and out in my garden in my alfalfa bed. And then I threw in some water. I threw in a couple of teaspoons of bee pollen. I threw in uh, three tablespoons full of flaxseed and then uh, some stevia leaves, dry stevia leaves, and some dry shredded coconut. And I blended it very well and I made it very watery and I drank it all up. I drank it all and I'm getting rehydrated that way as well and getting all that nutrition. As a supplement with my breakfast, I also had a teaspoon, a heaping teaspoon of spirulina because I felt I needed it. I felt a little tired yesterday. And um, later in the day, I will probably make another wonderful shake, but this time it will, it will be a Spanish-inspired gazpacho, and I will throw in some cherry tomatoes, some onion, some garlic, some olive oil, some water, some uh, cider vinegar, organic, some sea salt, some pepper, a heaping teaspoon of paprika, maybe some red bell pepper as well, some basil if I wish, and then uh, I will blend it very well and drink it all, and if I want some solids, I can have some green beans and, and uh, green peas, you know, chopped with some lemon, a little bit of olive oil as well. And then to conclude the day, this perfect day that I intend to have today, I will make a sort of a raw lasagna. I will uh, cut zucchini into thin layers and place them and then spread over them a very thick pesto, a raw pesto made of basil. I have two kinds of basil. I have uh, the green kind and the cinnamon basil variety. And, uh, throw in the basil, throw in some garlic, throw in a lot of sun, sunflower seeds, as I have no uh, pine nuts, and some olive oil and salt and pepper, and uh, make it really thick.
spread it and place layers of zucchini over it and do another layer. I can also squash some tomatoes in there. Um, use spinach leaves also as a kind of layer and eat that, you know. And I can also use a little bit of a flax seed in my pesto as well, along with the sunflower seeds. And that will make it more hearty, and more nutritious. There'll be more omega-3, 6, and 9, which are so important to me. It's important to act on the information you gather. You know, it's important to empower yourself, empower yourself to, to eat well, to eat clean food, to eat nutritionally uh, dense foods. Uh, these foods represent the ideal support for well-being uh, at all the other levels of, of existence, such as our state of mind, our emotional state, our mental clarity, it's important. Nutrition is very important. We are physical beings and we need, we need to take care of nutrition. We are biological beings. That's what we need. So, good luck to everyone with their organic endeavors and their nutrition. We can do it. We can do it.